It's a new segment here on Halton News, and it's called What's Happening Halton? And joining me is Cameron Wilkinson from Mornings on Milton 101. How you doing, Cam? I'm doing pretty good. Thank you so much for having me. Thanks for doing this. Now, of course, this is a huge weekend in Halton, specifically in Burlington. The Sound of Music Festival is back. Everyone's been waiting years for it. I mean, being on the radio, spitting out a lot of the hits. Who are you interested in seeing this weekend at the Sound of Music? Well, I mean, a big Canadian act that's playing on Friday is The True. So a lot of people are looking forward to that, as well as uh, on Saturday. It's sort of a early 2000s throwback with Finger Eleven and Biff Naked, which is going to be a lot of fun. Well, you know, Finger Eleven is going to be uh, beloved because they're in their own town. I got to say, though, you picked my personal favorite out of the entire weekend. And that is Biff Naked. She is a sweetheart, Canada's punk rock princess. Definitely looking forward to chat- checking that out. But we focused a lot on Sound of Music. Aside from that, let us in. What else is happening this weekend in the region? Well, if you don't want to pay for a music festival, you can head down to Milton for the downtown Milton Summer Fest. It's the, the biggest party of the summer, as I like to say, taking a line from the WWE for their Summer Slam event. Uh, it's got a bunch of unique vendors. You've got food, drinks, live entertainment, kids' activities. It's going to be noon to 8 p.m. on Milton's Main Street on Saturday. It's free to attend. Obviously, the, the vendors aren't going to be free, but it's, it's going to be free to just be there all day and to take in the sun. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it's going to be a sunny day. Yeah, and you know, this is really one of those things where much like Sound of Music, you know, getting back out there and having festivals is great because we're doing it once again. This summer has started feeling a little bit normal, dare I say, which is great. So that's the Saturday. On Sunday, it's Father's Day. How should people celebrate? We have the For the Love of Fathers and Food Trucks events, the first annual thing that this is happening for. It's bringing the community together. We've got food. Obviously, it's a food truck event. Mm-hmm. Drinks, marketplace goodies, music playing, axe throwing. Jason, I don't know about you, but I tried axe throwing for the first time last weekend. I'm awful at it. It's a very hard activity. Uh, proceeds from this event are going to the Commission Society, which is or the Compassion Society, rather, which is helping food and uh, clothing for local residents. And again, that is this Sunday, 11 a.m., 5 p.m., Milton Fairgrounds. I love how when they say it's fun for the whole family and axe throwing is there. I feel as though that's a slight danger if someone's been in some sort of family argument. Yeah, duck. That's all you need to know. Well, thanks for the info, Cam. And listen, you're going to be back here in a couple weeks. We'll have Carla on next week to do this again. But if people want to hear you guys every day, where can they hear you? 101.3 101.3 FM. It's uh, MiltonNow.ca as well if you want to listen live and uh, you can listen around the world if you want.